Frontier Design is a Toronto design studio. Uh, we work in branding, graphic design, and spatial design as well. Uh, we also produce our own magazine and editorial content, as well as our self-directed ventures projects like the Frontier 2. We think that actually those three things help each other because you know, our magazine work helps us become more informed and really better communicators. And then our ventures work is all based on coming to understand how a product comes to market. And, and when we learn that process in a really detailed way, we apply all that learning to client work too. So we think we're actually better service providers or better consultants because of the magazine and the ventures that we do. And I think that makes us pretty different. Uh, and so when we were deciding on our first venture, we thought what more Canadian and what more sort of iconic than a toque. And so the real challenge was to think, how can we take the tools and process of design and rethink something that we know every day and, and make it better? A self-directed project like the toque is the most exciting one for us, where we get to put all of our passion into something we really, really care about and is completely done internally. So to be able to make something like the Frontier Tube from scratch and see it through from research and development uh, to finding the right materials to going through fashion designers, talking to biomimicry specialists and then seeing it actually come to fruition and dealing with supply chain and, and getting our tube to market, that's been so exciting for the whole studio. The thinking behind the Paul Haber project was really to showcase the Paul Haber wordmark, um, drawing attention to uh, the curvatures and the flourishes of Fall Haber F and um, really coming on brand strong. Learn about Frontier and all the projects that we're doing right now at frontier.is. Uh, you can also take a look at the magazine online and there you'll be able to pre-order the Frontier Toque. Um, if you want to buy it in stores, it'll be at Uncle Otis here in Toronto.